Welcome to Zoom Education. Today I'm going to be showing you how to access your video and audio settings within Zoom. So typically when new users join the first meeting, they'll be met with this join audio by computer message. And you can also see it in the bottom left of the meeting window. When you click this, all this is going to do is allow the Zoom client to access your speaker and audio device. So I'm going to go ahead and select that. And as you can see, um, it changed the symbol to this mute symbol. It automatically detects your default input audio device and if you click the arrow next to it you can select different microphones that are available and also select a different speaker so you can use different output devices with different input devices now if you go where it says start video um, click the arrow next to that and you can select which camera you want to use right now I'm using the Logitech so I'm gonna go ahead and start my video and you can see me appear here you can also change the camera, so I'm going to go ahead and change it to my laptop camera, and it does it pretty seamlessly, and here I come. The quality isn't as great on that camera, so I'll switch back. And that's how you access the audio and video settings within a Zoom meeting. Now, if you actually open up the Zoom application and sign in, um, you can get to this homepage right here, and you can access your audio and video settings if you click this button that says Settings, and this window will appear. Now on a Mac it'll look a little different. Uh, the audio video settings will actually display horizontally instead of vertically uh, as opposed to the Windows client. So as you can see here, you can change your speaker, which one you want to do in the drop down menu. And when you click test speaker, it's actually going to play a sound just to make sure your speakers are working with Zoom. You can change your microphone as well. And you can see it's picking up uh, my input as this little level is going up and down and I have mine set to automatically adjust the microphone. You don't have to, you can change it to whatever you know, max volume you'd like on that device. And if you go to the video tab, you can see me already appear, and my Logitech is selected, but you can choose another one if you'd like. And if you uh, go to these uh, video options, you can enable mirror effect for the video, and this is just gonna you know, help you uh, do presentations because um, this will actually switch to your orientation, so I'm actually moving my left hand and it matches what I see on the screen so it's not confusing you can always show your name on the video window so other participants can see your name next to your video or default profile picture you can always turn off video when joining any meeting so your video won't automatically come on you can actually hide non-video participants in your own meetings as well um, and that would be for you if you have your picture off and there's also this capture 720p by default now this actually just changes the aspect ratio to 16:9 um, instead of a, a 4 by 3 uh, aspect ratio. And um, as you can see, it kind of just uh, winds my picture there a little bit and makes everything come into, come into view. And one thing I forgot to mention is you know how you saw the join audio by computer? Um, if you select right here, automatically join audio by computer when joining a meeting, you won't have to join your audio every time. It'll do it automatically. So that's all you need to know about accessing your audio and video settings within Zoom. Hope you guys learned something new.